my brother here in Bakersfield was probably at one point in time one of the most popular gang members as a teenager. Like then I got into it myself and I I was trying to outdo him, trying to take it to a whole nother level. And it just it, it didn't feel good inside when I was doing it, but I was blocking all that away. He taught me how to build my relationship with Christ taught me how to build up myself and understand and gave me confidence. And then he taught me how to love and be united with others. We always knew that uh, family was important. When we first established the church, we always talked about the importance of marriage. And we knew that it's important for our families to be um, cohesive and to be able to work together. Uh, and building strong families will build a strong church. And then a lot of stuff was happening to me really fast. and. Uh, you know, the money was coming, but I had no peace. And I was like, okay, well, if I buy this, I'll be able to pe uh, have peace. And it got to a point where my kids started getting older. And then I, I would, like, we'd go out on family outings and everybody would be laughing, having a good time. And I'd just be, I wouldn't know what's wrong. As soon as I surrendered all, I instantly got peace. And from there, I took that and I ran with it. We've never had spiritual growth like this. And the transition was easy because we were doing it together. There's nobody too high, nobody too low for us not to connect with. Mm -hmm. And I think we've all in some areas been high and been low in those areas in our lifetime. So we connect with everybody. Uh, we have come from a background where, you know, we didn't grow up having everything. Uh, we don't have everything at this point in time, but we noticed that there's been a progression with God over the years. Mm -hmm. And doing so, we look back at other people and we tell them, you know, we're kind of trailblazing that we may be able to you know, knock the Goliath down so other people can come on and follow us. Ever since I started coming to the cross, a lot of stuff just been changing in my life. And ever since that day I came on a Tuesday night, I just never stopped coming.